For more videos visit forthesakeofeducation.com Alright guys, now we're gonna do this problem where they want you to find the resultant force acting on point A and there's two forces. So the first thing you wanna do is find the position vectors of all the points involved. A sits at 0i plus 0j plus 6k. B sits at 3i minus 2j plus 0k. C sits at 2i plus 3j plus 0k. So the vector AV is found by subtracting the vector A from the vector B and it comes out to be 3i minus 2j minus 6k. The magnitude of AB is found by doing the square root of the sum of the square of the values. So when you plug in these three values into this formula, you're going to get that the magnitude is exactly 7. And now you can find the univector AB by dividing the vector AB by its magnitude. So dividing these three values by 7 is going to give you the univector which comes out to be 0.429i minus 0.286j minus 0.857k. With the univector you can find the, this is the univector, now you can find the Cartesian vector form of this force by multiplying the magnitude of Fb which is 840. So you multiply the magnitude by the univector AB and you get the Cartesian vector form of AB. So multiplying 840 by these three values is going to give you 360i minus 240j minus 720k. And that's our first Cartesian vector, which is FB. Now we're going to do the same thing to find F of C. Basically, you're going to need to find vector AC, which is vector C minus vector A, which comes out to be 2i plus 3j minus 6k. Now you're going to find the magnitude of AC, just like you did here. And it comes out to be 7 again. Now the univector AC is found by dividing the vector AC by its magnitude and comes out to be 0.286i plus 0.429j minus 0.857k and to find the force Fc all you gotta do is multiply the magnitude of Fc times the univector AC and you know that the magnitude of Fc to be 420 because it's given right here so Fc comes out to be 120i plus 180j minus 360k. With those uh, two Cartesian vector forms of the forces Fb and Fc, you can find the resultant force, which is Fc plus Fb. So by adding the x with the x, the y, with the y and the c with the c you're gonna get that the resultant force is equal to 480i minus 60j minus 1080k but they're asking you for the magnitude of this resultant force and the magnitude of the resultant force is found by doing the square root of the x component square plus the y component square plus the c component square which are these three and when you plug them into here you get that the magnitude is 1183 newtons of course final answer final answer for the Cartesian vector form of Fc and final answer for the Cartesian vector form of Fb 
please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.